really bad right now. Just ignore it. What you were saying about your children, that was funny. I laughed. I don't know how I feel about having kids. I don't think I'm gonna have kids. If I do have kids, what I decided was that I would adopt a half-white, half-black African child that has an awesome accent and green eyes. If I decided I wanted another kid, I would want a girl. That way, the African son would protect my beautiful little girl. I have my retainers in right now. And I feel that I talk a lot clearer when they're not in my mouth. So... My mother. I have an aunt that is ridiculously wealthy. She has these really awesome stairs that like... They go um, around. That's what that was. Uh, and as you're coming down the stairs, there's this mirror. You can you can like watch yourself as you're coming downstairs. And so my mom was watching herself and she was going down the stairs like. And I guess her foot like slipped off of the the step. So she went to go step on it and it slipped and she landed on her ankle on its side. She landed on it like that. <laughs> oh my gosh, a bunch of shit just fell out. Floor, foot, douche. What the heck? That thing! I know what it's called, but I don't know what it's called. I don't want to like say what I think it's called and then be like totally wrong. It sounds like a retard. The yellow instrument thing. It's really awesome. Wish I had one. But I've got a melodica, so... Alex Pardee signed something specifically... How did that even... What? Awesome! That's so rad. <sighs> Nobody loves me. Just kidding. Cursing? Yeah. That is also something... Yes. No cursing in these videos. We shouldn't curse in these. And I feel as though when people curse all the time, they're like, F and this and F and that and like in everyday conversation is what I mean. When they are angry, it doesn't mean squat. And when I say squat, I mean sh It was funny that you were like, oh, flipping the hair. There's no hair to flip because I'm getting my hair cut. I'm getting my hair cut like really short. Not like super duper short, not like boy short, but close. Because I've always had my hair, in 7th grade my hair was like really, 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 it was long. My hair was really long. And then I got it cut, because I was like, ah, long hair sucks. Such a hassle. Um, which is true. It's, I hate having long hair. I hate it. Which is why like now when I'm like, wow, my hair is getting really long in comparison to how short it was. I'm like, this is kind of exciting. I wonder what this is going to be like this time around, thinking that it's going to be different. Stupid. It's not different. It sucks. I hate having long hair. And I'm over it. So I'm going to cut. I love you. I don't know why. You did something in your video that made me love you, and I wrote it down. Christopher Watkins. <laughs> Mitchell Davis, right? Okay, for me, my video methods, I think it kind of depends, like, I don't know, other other than, like, special things, then I definitely just talk to the camera for a long time, and then edit. I think that's the best way, because you never know what things are going to say to, that just come off the top of your brain. I feel a little weird about, uh, just video blogging. Blogging in general because like, just like so many people with advancing technology are, are now starting to video blog and and have been video blogging for a long time and it's just it, it's a new thing I think especially with like new media but in most vlogs it's all the same you know it's just like people just talking to their camera just talking to no one but video blogging is definitely I think it's a really good outlet for people to talk to people. Communication is a really 
really important thing for mankind to embrace and there are a lot of people in the world that don't know how to in person. I really feel that YouTube is a really great medium for people to express themselves and also get feedback from people whether it's negative or positive. It's like when you start this, you know you're going to get haters and you're going to get you're going to get people that are totally supportive of you and that totally like you and think you're awesome. So I think that it's that it's really awesome. Definitely in my family, I am completely like ridiculed for it. My like step family really like is contemptuous towards me for like sitting and watching other people talk about their lives. And I don't think they understand. It's a new phenomenon. It's just like watching a movie or it's just like discovering new artists, you know, to get to hear other people's stories and to get to hear what other people are going through in their lives and to relate to people. That's what being a human being is all about, is finding what you have in common with other human beings and communication and building friendships, even if you don't know the person. I don't even know. Just, woo. Moving on. Editing. I use iMovie HD, which is for Max. I love Max. Max, I love the best in my opinion. That picture was awesome. <laughs> stupid, stupid. So let's get a little serious here. We've made a little Venn diagram. I'm not sure if this is what you were talking about, but I'm pretty sure it is. Mum's ankle, the Holocaust, and both. So I'm just gonna begin to make this now. Um, I feel as though this diagram has turned into a diagram comparing my mother and Hitler instead of the Holocaust. I think I'm gonna stop here. I think that's probably a good place to stop. Okay. <laughs>